First, take out of all items from the package. The package includes manual, monitor, sunshade, yield bracket, 3M sticker, test wire, cigarette lighter adapter, power cord, antenna, other accessories, windshield mount, fur iron bracket, and camera. Please note, the suction cup bracket is not included in the package. Pick up the monitor. Install two of the antennas on the monitor. Please install them at the same time. Loosen the screw. The bracket can be flexibly adjusted. After adjusting the angle, tighten the screw. Pick up the 3M sticker. Tear off the 3M sticker. Paste it on the bottom of the monitor bracket. You can tear off the other side of the 3M sticker and stick it on the dashboard. Now I'll introduce how to install the windshield bracket. Loosen the screws and pull up the buckle. Loosen the screws on the monitor and remove the U-shaped bracket. Align the bracket with the hole on the back of the monitor and snap it in. You can mount it on your windshield or dashboard. Follow my operation. The windshield bracket can rotate 3 by 60 degrees flexibly. After adjusting the angle, tighten the screw. Tear off the protective film on the bottom of the bracket and place it on the dashboard, then pull down the buckle to fix it. Install the other two antennas on the camera. Please do not cross the two antennas, the signal will be reduced. Pick up the test wire. Connect one end of the two connectors of the test wire to the monitor. Connect the other end of the test wire's two connectors to the camera. Connect the other end of the test wire to the cigarette lighter adapter. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power outlet. Press the red button. The red button lights up. Tear off the protective film on the camera before use. The monitor lights up and the image appears on the screen. Nine IR lights on the camera. This is an IR sensor. The infrared light is on, the image becomes black and white. When the infrared light is off, the image becomes colorful. The testing finished. Now disconnected all the wires. The easiest way is connect the monitor to cigarette lighter outlet. Plug the cigarette lighter adapter to the power outlet. Press the red button. The red button lights up. The monitor lights up and shows no signal. Pick up the camera screws. Use screws to fix the camera in a suitable position on the car.
connect the power cord to the camera. Red is positive, black is negative. Please test positive and negative in advance. The red wire is connected to the positive wire of the reverse lights, running lights, tail lights. The black wire is connected to the negative of the reverse lights, running lights, tail lights. The image appears on the screen. When not entering the menu mode, touching the left or right keys does not respond. Touch the third key to enter quit the menu mode. Touch the power key to turn off on the screen. When you insert the SD card, touch the OK key to turn on or off the recording function. Touch the sixth key to switch to the CM2 channel. Touch the sixth key again to switch to the CM3 channel. Touch the sixth key again to switch to the CM4 channel. Touch the sixth key again to switch to the quad mode. In the quad screen state, touching the left right third key has no effect. Touch the sixth key again to switch to the CM1 channel. Touch the V key to quickly enter the video playlist, which cannot be entered when the SD card is not inserted. Touch the third key to quit the menu mode. Touch the third key to enter the menu mode. The first icon is the pairing signal. If the product you received has an image, the monitor cannot enter pairing mode. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the picture. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key, the icon turns red. Touch the left or right keys to adjust the brightness. Touch the OK key to confirm. The icon turns yellow. Touch the left or right keys to switch to contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to adjust the contrast. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the HUE. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to adjust the hue. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the sharpness. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to adjust the sharpness. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the third key to return to the previous interface. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the mirror flip. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to select the mode you need. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the mode. Touch the OK key to confirm. You can choose the split mode you need, such as two splits. Touch the OK key to select the first icon. Touch the third key to quit the menu mode. Touches the sixth key to switch to the camera channel. Now it's split mode when in split screen mode, the third and fourth camera channels are not displayed. Touch the sixth key again to switch to the CM1 channel. Touch the third key to enter the menu mode. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the mode. Touch the OK key to confirm. If you want to open the four camera channels, touch the left or right keys to switch to the seventh icon. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the third key to quit the menu mode. Touches the sixth key to switch to the camera channel. Touch the third key to enter the menu mode. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the system. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the OK key, the icon turns red. Touch the left or right keys to select the language you need. Touch the OK key to confirm. 
Touch the left or right keys to switch to the time. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to adjust the year. Touch the OK key to switch to the month. Adjust year, month, day, hour, minute, second in turn. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the P line. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to turn off on the guidelines. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the third key to quit the menu mode. Turn off the monitor's power. Use tools to remove the back cover. Insert SD card. Close the back cover and tighten the screws with tools. Turn on the monitor's power. The red dot flashes, indicating that the monitor is recording. When you insert the SD card, there is a yellow SD card icon on the screen. Touch the third key to enter the menu mode. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the record. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the format. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to turn on the format the SD card. Touch the OK key to confirm. When you insert a new SD card, please format the SD card first. Touch the OK key turn off the record. Touch the OK key again turn on the record. Touch the third key to enter the menu mode. Touch the left or right keys to switch to the play. Touch the OK key to confirm. Touch the left or right keys to select the video you want to watch. Touch the OK key to confirm. Follow my operation. Touch the OK key to pause or play the video. Touches the third key to return to menu mode. Touch the third key to quit the menu mode. Touch the V key to quickly enter the video playlist. Touch the third key to quit the menu mode. Long touch the right key to turn on the guideline. Long touch the right key again to turn off the guideline. Long touch the right key to turn on the guideline. When the guideline appear on the screen, Touch the right key, the H appear on the screen. Touch the left key to adjust the height of the guideline. Touch the right key, the M appear on the screen. Touch the left key to move the guideline to the left or right. Touch the right key, the W appear on the screen. Touch the left key to adjust the width of the guideline. Touch the right key, the letters disappear. Pick up the second camera. Mount the antenna on second camera. Connect the power cord to the second camera. Red is positive, black is negative. Please test positive and negative in advance. 
The LED wire is connected to the positive wire of the reverse lights, running lights, tail lights. The black wire is connected to the negative of the reverse lights, running lights, tail lights. Touch the sixth key to switch to the CM2 channel. Touch the third key to enter the menu mode. Touch the OK key to enter the pairing countdown. Connect the power cord to the camera. An image appears on the screen, indicating a successful pairing. Cover the camera with your hand and press the sensor with your finger. You can see the arrow light on. Touch the sixth key to switch to the split screen. Both channels have images. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom. 